Hi guys, today we're going to do um, ranking jerseys in Ireland. The first one we're going to do is Tipperary. Okay, let's get into it. Now, this Tipperary jersey is actually a very nice jersey. Um, the nice yellow in the middle, the yellow stripes on top. The sleeve's not the best, but I'm going to rate this jersey. 10th place. Now for Kale Kenny. Kale Kenny have gotten a very nice jersey and that's why this jersey is one of the nicest out there and I'm going to rate this 4th place. And the reason why is I really like the black on top. The sponsor is alright and the black and amber just suits the jersey with the O'Neills. Now we're going to do Calvin. Calvin were success, sex, successful in the All-Ireland last year, but not as successful this year. Now, they do have a nice jersey, but if you do zoom in on the Calvin jersey, you do find a couple of squares, and that's why this jersey for me is definitely 15th place. No higher, no lower. Okay, another Ulster team. Now, we're going to go into Armagh. Armagh are a good team. They didn't do very well in the championship last year. But look, their jersey is really nice. Now, if you do zoom into it, you see these lines that aren't very nice. But let's be honest, look, it's hardly going to make a difference on screen. So I'm going to rate this Armagh jersey fifth place. Now for the me jersey. It's absolutely disgusting. It's got like these squares down here. Like with the sponsor Devonish. It's not a bad sponsor. But like it's the worst thing with all these squares. This jersey's the worst jersey I've ever done. Like, let's be honest, this is the worst jersey I've ever seen in the history of game football. Get this jersey off the screen. It's the most disgusting thing. No credit to me. 32nd place. They're out of this video. Cork jersey. Very nice jersey. Um, probably one of the best out there. Definitely top 10. 6th place. No question. Now for the Kerry jersey. It's an alright jersey, I think. I think it just can have a couple of changes. Take out all those lines all around. But just have a plain carry jersey. The last carry jersey was very nice to be fair to them now. But I'm going to rate this jersey 16th place. Now for the Dublin jersey. The nicest jersey out there. It's got these oh how clear, oh how clear. But this Dublin jersey is first place. Nothing in the history again. Football will stop it. Except, except for the last one. Yeah. Now for Fermanagh. Fermanagh have like white on the back for some reason, but they have green on the front. Now, this jersey is a really nice jersey. It's all, actually no, it's not really nice. It's all right. 13th. Now for Limerick, you know what? It's actually all right. It's got a couple of lines here and there, but it's a very nice jersey and I think you kind of have to give it. We're not going to be harsh, we'll give it 14th. Okay, now for Mayo. Mayo, pretty good. For it. They've been very successful. Got to the all Iron final last year. Dublin beat them to get six in a row. We all know that for good football fans. And I'm going to give this jersey a 7th place. Okay, now for Down. That thing is disgusting. 31st place. Down were lucky I didn't do this before Mead. Now they Mead was just about edge of it on disgrace. But still, it's real disgrace. I can't believe it. Down. 31st place. Get that off the screen. Like, oh my gosh. Kildare now. Kildare? Very nice. Um, we don't think we have enough space to put it in top 10. 
but I'll put it in um, 20s. Pretty good. Now for the Wicklow jersey. Now, I was saying that Wicklow jersey before this video would be in the top six. But then I did zoom into it and there's these things on it that I don't understand what they are. They look like these things that's going to screw up some concrete. But it's actually a nice jersey and it's not going to look badly on the it's not going to look bad on the pitch. Yes, it does have those things. I said it might not be in the top 10, but I said it would be like guaranteed. But I'm going to put it ninth. Oh, did that again? Now for Waterford. Waterford successful. They got to the auto in final last year and this year they came through the qualifiers and fair play to them. Now they're in the semi-final. And yeah, have a ha they're having a good championship in the last two years compared to 2019. Fair credit to them. Fair play to the, the likes of Tyke the Borka, Desi Hutchinson, Austin Wieson. So I'm gonna rank this jersey seventh place. Okay, now for Offaly. Offaly are going to get in 11th place. They just have a very nice jersey in the shape of the Irish flag. And yeah, I'm very happy with the Offaly jersey. Fair play to them. And I also like the Antrim jersey. 18th. And a really nice jersey is Claire. 19th. Okay, Sligo, brilliant jersey, such legends, and they're gonna get the I'll say that again. Um, I think the Sligo jersey is a quite a nice jersey. Twentieth place, fair play to them. Okay, now for Longford. Fair play to Longford. In fairness to them now, they're not doing very well. But these counties like Wicklow and Longford, they actually do good jersey. Like even the counties like Ross Common. They they don't do very well in the championship. But in fairness, they put really good jerseys. And that's why I'm gonna give them a high five and I'm gonna give them twenty third. Fair enough, Longford. Now for Danny Gas, and we're going to read this jersey 28th place. Tyrone jersey, absolutely disgraceful. Get it off the screen. We forgot our rating. 30th place. Now for Monaghan, have a nice jersey. 26th place, my G. Okay. Now for Westmead. Westmead? Alright. Eighth place. That's not alright. That's one of the best ones out there. Eighth place. Congrats. Congrats to Westmead. Go away. The jersey is not nice. 29th place. And guys, please don't forget to like and subscribe this video. And if you have subscribed, you still have to like. And if you haven't subscribed, still subscribe and like this video. Thanks very much.